Alright, and we get it. Um, we'll be getting this game started soon, so we can get back to And maybe I can find another commentator, but you know what? It's just fine if I don't, because I can solo commentate, probably. So this is going to be the other round of Lucy's quarters, which will bring us into top four. As a reminder, over on winner's side, we got SBS and we got Zora. So, whoever, uh, whoever wins this will be playing against Dinos. Yes, whoever wins this will be playing against Dinos. Winner plays the loser of uh, SBS and Zora, and you know how it goes from there. So they are electing to strike stages. It looks like we're going to Merchant Court anyway. All right. All right, so this game is starting off. Ah, starting with his usual approach. Ash having a bit of that touch of death property with his volcano. Off to a very early lead, but here comes Chompers. Oh, but that down to the down smash is gonna put the uh, some extra damage there. Up combo. Oh, but that's a raw, that's a pretty raw up smash. Takes the first, uh, takes the first stop. Oh, nice down strong. Oh, down B gets a little bit of a, some extra, extra sneaky damage. The way things are progressing right now, I'm, I'm, I'm foreseeing, I'm foreseeing Chompers having a little bit of a struggle killing, uh, getting kills on, on Ash, but he might be just about to prove me wrong. Oh, worms his way out of a kill there. Oh, but you know what? Raw up strong, raw up strong. I see it, I see it. each other throwing some hitboxes out, but the combo is starting to belong to Chompers for now. Ash is trying to make something out of that enhanced side beat. You can bounce on the bubbles. Okay. You know what? That's pretty true to form. away with an up strong but wasn't quite there for it. It's starting it is looking as though it's both Ooh, nice little up air catch. It's looking as though both of these guys are having some trouble really solidly comboing each other. I I can't say I see I foresee any zero to deaths here. Which is strange because that's there's one thing that I could associate with characters like Orcan and Shovel Knight. It's zero to deaths. Oh god. That that was a bit scary. And he wasn't quite able to recover, and that's it for game one. Chopper takes it. All right, so moving into the stage bands here. We see bands on relatively small stages. Growlful, Pond, it is, which is a little bit of a power move, if you ask me, because this is definitely a stage that we've known that Ash really liked personally. Though, it might also just be a smart move because of those triplats. Definitely suiting, uh, definitely suiting a character like Shovel Knight. Kind of a slow neutral at the moment, but oh boy. I think Chompers might just be banking on his ability to get those off, uh, off the side kills faster than uh, Ash can. I'm still sh still shaken up over the fact that you can just bounce on Fortane's ship. Oh my god, he actually just goes down and grabs a fish for his troubles. Not quite, doesn't quite have the time for, have the time for shopping, not that I know of. Oh, okay. Stop. Chompers wasting no 
no time getting back into the action. to parry something, man. That would have been a kill. Almost certainly. Oh, he sneaks in a little bit of a, of a purchase there, but uh, the down airs. You ever just down air off the stage? I did that so many times in the, in the actual Shovel Knight game. It sucks. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's a heavy combo right there. Finally answers back with the stock. No efficient. Recover safely. Oh, uh, but oh boy. He's hoping to... I'm not sure what he was going for. I'm really not sure what he was going for. I think... I think he was just a little bit too low for that to, uh, for that to work, whatever it was. Takes it back, brings brings a set count to one all. And we're going to Glacial Bastion. Forgot the name for a moment. Getting started off. Oh wow, that's just three dash attacks. Um, tech reading. That's a way to get into your head, uh, into your opponent's head. God, that forward tilt. That forward tilt. Uh oh. Or Kane has you off stage, and he's at 69% not anymore. Ooh, tried to go for something sneaky with that, with that enhanced side beat. Nothing really doing now. Uh oh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, nice little forward strong there. To throw him off. Okay, we got the we got the sand block, but we have the ceiling tech. Thank you, Dan. And we have another ceiling tech. Oh my goodness, this strong, this fully charged up strong. It's not may not quite be helping uh, Chompers as much as he had hoped, because it, it's now allowed um, Ash to live what was most likely a kill move twice in a row now. And he hasn't really made, uh, gotten the chance to make much use of it to get its gold. Uh oh. Ooh. I feel like I feel like Chompers was expecting to land on one of those platforms, and he just didn't. Which caused him to eat that down smash that he apparently that he pretty clearly seemed not ready for. Chompers finally able to go shopping and. Finally seals out that kill on, oh, I think it was almost like 100% damage. And it took just kind of a raw read of an, uh, read on an F strong. Ash trying to check, uh, trap dinos, uh, excuse me, trap chompers into something. That's another, ah, uh, that's another parry trade. Going fishing. Oh, but here could be a combo. Oh, but you fool. You trapped him at 69%. Oh, boy. Doesn't quite have the DI read right. Uh, tries to go for a swing, but it doesn't really connect. Oh, nice forward smash read. More of like a punish, but... Ash up one stock. Ooh, but the bubble parry lets him get a little bit of that stage advantage. Ash able to take it back though. Oh, he wanted to parry it. He wanted to just sit there and parry it, but he just couldn't quite get the timing right. That seems rather difficult, if you ask me. Good punish from uh, Chompers. There, nice, nice tech chase. All right, yeah, it was more like a tech chase. Okay, it's a tech chase. Ooh, the parry throws off, uh, throws off Chompers just a little bit. 
This is already looking to be a pretty heated set uh, coming into here. Oh, that an up air or just about any sort of uh, standard or cake kill move is gonna be the end of this game. Ooh, but the Tinker Knight weapon, oh my god. The double parry, but but Ash was actually able to just kind of take advantage of that, uh, of that little pause it took to parry. Oh, but here comes a combo, trying to connect it with an up tilt. Could have meant a kill at that rate. Especially if he could have gotten a tech read. Oh, but he just runs in there and up strongs and takes game three. Ash up one game. Boys to move into winner's sem- uh, excuse me, to lose semis. Tower of Heaven. Battlefield War. And we got Zora here. This has been a pretty it's been a pretty good set so far. Alrighty. So yeah, it's actually been pretty wild. Um Ash doing pretty good, man. Yeah, Ash is doing pretty great. Chompers had a really uh, had a really strong start. Um and honestly not to say that he's been uh, that he's been slowing down in, in these last few games, but Ash is really bad. Ash has really been uh, starting to turn things up. And he's not letting up at, uh, at the beginning of this game four. Has him no, on stage. He's not, man. He's looking for a 3-1 and just ending it. Getting to the next game. As well he should. I get the feeling that if, uh, yeah, that if uh, Chopper's going to get any sort of momentum to... Oh, from the other side of the stage. But if, as I was saying, if Chopper's can get any sort of momentum to break that game four, he honestly... Would, well, I would yeah. I would consider him very likely to take the uh, take the fifth game and uh, win out the set. <laughs> that was cute. Okay. Yep. So okay. He he's still <laughs> you oh, bitch. So he's still trying to learn a lot of matchups with Shovel Knight, right? And yeah. Orkane's a really tricky one. Oh, I I bet. If you don't know how to fight Orkane with your character, Orkane gets so much mileage out of just early kills and just like. The, my, the dude's a punish machine. Right? Okay. So, so you, last you game, slip up, you might just die. I, like he's he's well beyond. <laughs> <laughs> I love that little. Oh grin. my god. Okay. Chomper's Ash got, is mad. Chomper's has got a hella grin. I love it. But anyway, and he's doing good though, man. He's. <laughs> we go in fishing, boys. <laughs> that was actually really cool. I like, oh, I like okay. using it to make like a hitbox. That's, that's pretty silly. Okay, so does Chompers do this shit a lot where he just kind of does some silly stuff? Do you think there's any sort of mentality thing to it, or uh, is he know, just being it, a shit lord? This character's still new to him. You know? This character is still super fun. He's explained yeah. to me many times that his favorite part of playing Rivals of Aether is learning how to oh. play the characters. Again, is just relearning the game from the ground up. He loves that that initial period where everything is new, everything's a challenge, everything is there for you to learn. <gasps> and he shows it. <laughs> <laughs> he shows that he can do that here, man. I've seen so many really ups, wants uh, upstrong kills from from Chomper so far. I think he just really likes that move. So you got to be really careful though, as Chomper right here, because that's a uh, that arcade can kill you. Ah, as he that was pretty did. good. So he's learned now. He's figuring out the matchup. He's I think a better so. Feel for it. It's just tricky. Yeah, but it really is. But either way, that's good stuff to. Definitely, that is Ash. a good win. And uh, Ash is going to be going up against, uh, I believe, Dinos. Dinos has Dinos. had to fight so Should. much Orkane. But you're up first, it seems. Oh. Yeah. We got winners finals. It's SBS and Zone. I can take care of it if you, if you need. Kitty. It's he. Man, I got hella headache right now. Anyone, do you know if anyone around has, has like Tylenol or something? Got it. All right, I'm going to see if I can...
I haven't been on the mic all day. I love how nobody said anything in chat since I put my emote in there. <laughs> yeah, that's all that's all that's needed in the world. I'm surprised I won that. I'm really bad at that matchup. How did I win that? <laughs> Well, in all fairness, a lot of the times, like, I the only 